All right, in this video, we're going to be talking about locations. And um, when I set up a campaign for the first time, I want to make sure I'm doing two things. Number one, I'm targeting the right locations, the right zip codes, the right areas. And I'm excluding the areas where I do not want people to see my ads. And for the most part, I like to exclude the rest of the world. So um, if I'm in Texas advertising, uh, I'm only going to open up my ads to the state of Texas and maybe just to that geographical uh, region, whether it's you know Dallas or Houston. Um, you know that's that's going to give me a lot of control over who gets to see the ad. And um, when you set up your account that way and you exclude locations, that can really help you eliminate a lot of uh, unqualified leads. If you've ever picked up the phone and you know somebody called you from another state, there's probably something wrong in here in your location settings. Um, so exclusions are important. And there's also another option here, which is tucked right below your setup, location options. And I recommend that you are targeting people that are in your targeted location. I, I stay away from, for the most part, people who are um, showing an interest in your targeted location. What I mean by that is if, um, you know, if you're located right now in San Diego, California, and in San Diego, you type in Boston Plumber and you see a Boston plumbing ad in San Diego, you have expressed an interest in finding a plumber in Boston. And if you see an ad, then that particular uh, plumber has this targeting option activated. Okay. Um, or there's a, there's a huge mess up in how these locations are, are set up. Um, it, this is such an easy thing to set up. It's also a very easy thing to forget. So um, long story short, I'll tell you a quick, a quick, quick one here. Uh, when I set up a huge heating account, uh, it was a Saturday, maybe two years ago, and um, it was like 4 a.m. in the morning I came in. I knew it was going to take a long time, and um, I had started to work on it, and I like to work uh, live when I'm working on a big account because it helps the account ramp up much faster. And um, basically, just I, I set up the ad group, I set up the ads, and Starbucks was opening up like 5:36 a.m. and um, I left. I let I let the ads run, and it's early in the morning, and I didn't think anything of it. Um, and I had I I didn't get to the point in my checklist where I had set up locations. So by the time I got back, the campaign had accrued like $1,800 in ad spend in 20 minutes. That's because the ad was running pretty much the entire United States. And um, so, yeah, that was an expensive cup of coffee. Luckily, I was able to get a credit uh, for that mistake. But um, you always want to make sure that you're targeting uh, the right locations. Otherwise, um, it can cost you a lot. Hey, it's Steve with Ad Machines. Thanks for uh, watching my training video. There's a lot more that uh, I have built. All you have to do to, to watch videos just like this one, go to freeppctraining.com. That's freeppctraining.com. Thank you, and uh, hopefully uh, we're helping you uh, have an impact here on your lead generation performance. Yeah.